and welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are new. So today I'm going to be doing a bullet journal 2021 flip through for the opening part and January. So I bought three bullet journals for like $7.95 and that was so I could have one for the first half of it, one for the second part of it and one for like maybe next year or even like just like doodling or something so I bet you can't guess which one I'm using first there's a brown one, a white one and a black one which one did I do? clearly it was this one so without further ado let's get on into the video also just wanted to point this out really quick I did originally do a like plan with me but I didn't like it, so I'm doing this instead. Happy New Year and Merry Christmas. So here's my new vlog. So this is my bullet journal. And at the start, it's just got some brown paper and it says, Dear 2021, please be good. And there's like a little bit of a highlight there of pink to tie in the whole theme. Sorry, one second. Then we have the grid space and cheat sheet, which Amanda Rachel does every year and I thought I'd try it. The squares aren't exactly even, but you know, sure. Then we have the goals for 2021. I have dance, school, and other. Sorry about the messy handwriting, like in these bits, but that's just like, spaced out evenly rather than all together. I thought it looked cool. Mm, it doesn't look as cool as I thought it would. Then the title's just like a light pink. Then it says future log across the top and it says, will this be better than 2021? The pr I mean, 2020. It just says future log and then will this be better than 2020? So then we move on into the future log which is this little booklet thing that Amanda Rachel Lee inspired me to do so we have January February March April May June and also I stuffed up the colors here because March and June are the same color so then I edited it so it'd work and put the other purple there but yeah that's how it looks it looks a lot better on camera except the purple looks really out of place but yeah, and that space is just empty. Then we have things to check out, which is music series. And then the pen had with black in from drawing the black lines. So then I had to switch ruler and now that pen's room forever. So story time was great there. Then we have content planner, which is YouTube and TikTok, which I uh, really like so far. If you can see, this page is really crumpled from where I watercolored it. That sucks. Then we have wish list and gift ideas with some rubbish presents. And then highlights of 2021, and I'll just fill it in and like write like what it was as it goes over. Then we move on to January, which is Among Us themed. And this is 2020 was the imposter. So we have a cyan, a well, cyan tealish colour yellow and orange and a pink which them colors don't look too good together it does look orange on camera but i promise it isn't that one looks more yellow but that one's yellow N that one actually looks half decent i'm just realizing how bad the coloring is it's fine no one else is gonna see it except the whole world then we have the calendar which is my favorite part and I just did like little dots of all the colours and I did put it in 20, um, 28, 29, 30 and 31 and then I've just like filled in some dates so far nothing else has came yet. Then we have Mood Tracker. Today is the second but I haven't filled that in yet so I will in a minute. So my goal was to do five pull-ups in a row by the end of the month. Play my fitness goal. So... Instead of having like all my goals at the front of my journal, which are all my goals, like throughout the whole year, 
the goals is just like I'm gonna do it every month and that's what I want to get by the end of the month to then achieve my goals for the whole year if that makes sense so then for the mood tracker the yellow is the happiest the pink is the saddest and I just go wherever I want so if I felt like sorry in the middle one of them colors so sort of happy you know what I mean so that works hopefully there won't be too much this color then we have the habit tracker so I always do it like the bars are in Among Us so basically if I do one of them things then I've put one and then I'll write like A which I haven't got to do yet so just bear that in mind and then we have the brain dump so basically I have the January and then it says one to three because they're the only days of the month and then I have a map of pull-ups, which is only one today because it's the first day of the month and I haven't done a couple of pull-ups in a while. So my, my record at the moment is three. So it just says Friday, Saturday, Sunday down the side. And then we have the events. The events which are going to go this way. Any information or personal feelings will just go in like these boxes. I've already wrote something on Saturday, so we're just going to ignore that. So guys, moving on to the back of my book, we have my year and pixels, and I really like the X, even though it didn't like look as how I wanted it to, but I ended up putting the L underneath it so it didn't waste space. So along this side, we have January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Breathe. And then down the side, we have, I'm not going to say them all, but we have 1 to 31, because that's how many days there are. And then... So each day I'm going to fill it in, which I haven't done so far, but I'm going to fill it in. So I wrote all the colours so I know which colours they are because I have 120 colours over hoo hoo pens and I have no clue which one's which. So, so I know I wrote the colours down the side and that's the colours you can use if you want to also use the same colours as me if you want to do it. If you have them. So that's sad, that's happy. I decided to do it that way. I don't know why because blue is like sad. But I don't really like green and I don't want to have to put green. <laughs> so, by the end of the year, it'll all be coloured in. And at the bottom, I think I'm going to do black spots where, like, obviously February only has 28 days. This year, 28, yeah. Come back here. So, I'll just colour them in black so you can, like, see. And obviously, some months only have 30 days. So, yeah. Moving on to the app. So guys, if you enjoyed today's video, please make sure to like and subscribe so you don't miss any more of my videos and so I know that people actually watch my stuff because the last video I posted got no views. So thank you all so much for doing that. So finish headboard, we will love that. There is going to be a room tour video coming very soon, but it's only going to happen like when my room is officially finished. So it's just like sorting out individual little things in my bedroom, which are going to make it so much better in the end and I can't wait for it to be done. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please make sure to like and subscribe. And I know I already said that, but I'm going to say it again. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.